but they're the same length, so I could technically try and mismatch. They're not going anywhere. Not going anywhere. Okay, perfect. Yeah. It's the same thing. It is, yeah. Because the thing is, I have slight astigmatism in one side, so I can feel it's much stronger in my left eye right now. Yes. Yeah. Your left eye is a lot, a lot stronger. There's a story here, but I'm gonna go do yoga first. So it's several days later after I've picked up my glasses, I bought the two pairs that you saw in the store and I figured I'd explain why it was necessary for me to purchase two more pairs of glasses. I didn't wanna have to, but when I left the US, I realized that I had left the reddish kind of pair that I only ever wore all the time. Like that was the only pair I had. Um, I'd left that in Maryland unintentionally, so when my parents tried to ship it back, they tried to charge us over $200 in customs fees, even though I had bought them in Canada, uh, because uh, they just probably assumed I bought them in the US and tried to like ship them for cheap and then keep, a, you know, whatever. So didn't love that. They wouldn't waive any of the fees, even though it was Canadian bought, and that's pretty common for customs, because they're like, oh, if we sell them here, why'd you buy them somewhere else? Like support the Canadian economy, right? Um, so we'll just take the money that we think you owe the Canadian economy for purchasing a good outside of Canada, even though I did. So yeah, all stupid, all insane, but I bought two new pairs of glasses. I really like these. These got the blue light tint on them and scratch resistance and they're from Bailey Nelson. We have these through work. I can go here to get two pairs of glasses and they're fully covered, which is awesome. And then the other pair I got were these blue ones that make my eyes look closer together than I would like, but I, I'm getting used to them a bit more and they've got, these are probably closer to the ones that I have if I ever see those glasses again, they're likely gonna incinerate them. But uh, yeah, I got these two pairs and I really, really like them. And I've been wearing them this week again and it's made it a lot easier to read because I was getting all that vision fatigue, um, like eye fatigue, everything like that because I have really bad astigmatism in my left eye. So putting them back on was like, woo, like hurt for like a day. And then it was good to go, felt so much better. And I could actually look at my screen for more than like 30 minutes. It's great. It is Saturday today and we are going to go see the new Thor movie, which is really exciting. But before we do that, I'm gonna take a nap, one. And two, I got my teeth cleaned this morning because I get my new set of 11 trays for Invisalign starting tomorrow, or Monday. So I have to get new attachments and things like that. So I figured I'd get my teeth cleaned before I had to start that entire process. And honestly, they were telling me how good my teeth look, which is really, really awesome because it's only been a little over five months, right? And they look banging. So I'm super psyched about that. I'm excited for a new set of trays because I've been using these for like, seven or eight weeks which is really gross compared to like normally I only use a set of trays for one week so don't love that I've had to use those for that long but excited for the new set regardless because it's Saturday, I went to the summer market hall that I go to basically every week. And before I left, you saw I picked up those gift cards that was slotted in at the beginning of the Seattle vlog. And I'm still planning for when I'm gonna spend all that stuff, but great that I have those gift cards and I'll do that whenever. Whenever I go shopping, I'll film it. I've been looking for new knickknacks and things because I purchased a new tray that you can probably see over here from HomeSense. And it's really hard to fill it out with things of different heights because there's not currently any holidays right now so normally I put a Christmas tree or like a little pumpkin of some kind on it for decor but it's the middle of summer so there's no, nothing I have for that right now oh this is these are my toothbrushes from the dentist this morning Mitraya Mitra Mitraya I'm not sure her name was Mitra and she was really really nice and I've been looking for new jewelry like gold and she had really cute like mismatched ones and things like that. And that's not usually my style, but I've also just never tried. So I was excited to give it a go. 
The two pairs I picked up were these paperclip ones, and then I forget the name, but she told me what these were called, and I can't remember, but they're the same length, so I could technically try and mismatch, and I haven't tried them on yet, so I'm gonna give them a go. She was also super sweet and nice. We chatted for like 10 minutes. Okay, so these are the two pairs. I put one in each ear so we could see the full effect. Again, same length, could wear them mismatched. This one makes a lot of noise. I went back to Burnt Apron again and I got another one of these Vita candles. So now I have two because this is my favorite lemon scented one that she only has over the summer. I got a little dish for tea, like, yeah, tea candles. I have my candle supplies and different things in here, but this is where I keep the tea lights. We did it, cheese. Oh, that's one of the frames I bought yesterday also that I forgot to share. Comes the seagull for the fish. <laughs> it's just like chilling. He's ready for fish too. <laughs> it is a beautiful Saturday in Vancouver. I spent the morning at the market. Actually, I slept until about noon and then I went to the market picked up one thing, just this little rainbow candle. I've been looking for an arch for a while to complement some of my other candles. And now it's about five. There is this really cool thing going on in Vancouver this week called the Festival of Light. And apparently three countries do it. It's Japan and Spain and Canada this year. So there's going to be a huge fireworks display at 10 p.m. So right now I'm gonna go grocery shopping because we're gonna meet up with Zoe. We're gonna do a little barbecue at her place, well, our friend's place that she's house sitting. And then we're gonna go see the lights together and the whole show on English Bay. So that is gonna be great. I hope I get some good footage of that. She is a Vancouverite, like she has lived here her whole life. So she'll know where to position us and where to put us so we can see the best view and angles of this entire thing. And it's like a 25 minute show, so it's pretty significant. So I'm super psyched about that. Wasn't gonna go originally because I've had such a long week and I've been super tired and I have vlogged precisely none of this week, honestly. Like I've just been chilling since we got back from Seattle and trying to just recharge and eat better and do all that kind of stuff. But this is something that I was talking to my dad this morning. I was like, you know what, let's make time for this because this doesn't happen every year. This isn't a thing that happens everywhere at all. So it's a really great opportunity to get outside and like experience Vancouver summer, right? <laughs> Were you gonna meow at me? You're trying. Yeah, that was a bird. All right, well, I'm gonna go outside for a mow. Woo! It doesn't look like there's flame. Oh, there's definitely flame, it's on. Oh, it on, yeah. Figured it out. Cool. Uh, and I love the cooking on now. Oh, great, yeah. It's frozen. Yeah, okay, there I did it. <laughs> You'll never know. We'll keep track. Will we though? I don't remember which one it was. Just oh, okay. One, but uh, I don't think it's gonna matter that much. Fine. We're gonna cook, cook the germs right out. Oh my god, we can eat outside. Yeah. From where did this start? Uh, Ferrari. Really? Okay.
by fireworks. We are not waiting until you're over because it's going to be way too busy. <laughs> I think he was having a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah, you got it. <laughs> I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> Time for my first spin class since June 3rd. It's July 28th. I also haven't vlogged this week, but it's been the hottest day of the year, basically all week. It's been 89 degrees Fahrenheit for the last three days, so it's been a warm one. I haven't been here in so long, I got the time wrong. Ah. We did it. We didn't die. We succeeded. We actually thrived quite a bit. I straight up ran to class. I didn't realize I was 10 minutes off. It started 10 minutes before I remember because I haven't been in so long. But that class went extremely well. And I'm getting myself some smoothie now. We are embarking on another late night ride. I have barely vlogged since Tommy's parents have been here, but I have a couple of baby clips you may have seen from the last few days because I've just been rolling right through. But it is, as you saw, about 10, 10 p.m. And we're going back to do a bike ride. We went two days ago and it was nice and it was great because it was pretty not crowded but we got back at like 11 30 so we're trying to leave a little earlier today um but probably the same thing's gonna happen because he wants to go for longer today so we're gonna get back around 11 30. uh and yeah uh tomorrow we are going to science world i believe so yeah we've had a lot of fun the last few days long weekend vibes lots of sleeping it's been really really fun so yeah i don't know if i'll film on the trail but that's where we're headed managed to get the camera out hi i just took the camera out but I didn't stop, but I just was trying to make sure I didn't drop anything <laughs> from my fanny pack. Woo! Woo! <laughs> After several months, two months, one month, basically, month and a half, these babies are back in my possession. This vlog is about two and a half weeks long, just a collection of stuff, because I wanted to get the Seattle vlogs together and out, and I wanted to post the Invisalign video. So this one is just a mishmash of all the things that we have gotten up to since I've been back. So the glasses, some shopping. I've done some other small business shopping recently, and it's been a very, very fun time, but I've just kind of halted that for a bit. I do think I'm gonna go out a little bit later this week to go pick up stuff. I haven't vlogged much like at all. Like I have very few clips from each day, I've used, as you've seen from this collection of like random things, but uh, yeah, it's just been uh, slow going, but the weather's been, it's just been so hot with the heat wave. There hasn't really been a ton going on that's been very film worthy, but I did start going back to spin and I think I'm going to go to three classes this week, which is really great because I actually canceled, or I paused my membership. I didn't fully cancel it because then I'd lose all the credits for class pass, but I paused it for two months after I got COVID because I realized that I wasn't going to be able to use them all up until like that point like I literally have 160 credits like that I'm just sitting with so I really need to like use them up so that's what I'm gonna be doing for a little bit but that's all gonna be in the next video and yeah that's uh, that's about it when I went shopping a couple of days ago I picked up these really cute stickers for um, you can kind of put them on like compass cards or just cards in general but it's a really cute sticker with a head and just like flowers in it isn't that really cool 
my nails are a disaster right now. But yeah, these are really, really cute. I bought those. And then I got the cookies for the second time, which you've probably seen like pictures of before now. So I got those twice. And then I got this little handmade clay pot. I really like the style. I've been looking for more cute shelf decor or just like decor pieces that I could pick up and use just in small batches like this. I really love how this table looks with the two sides and with the photos in the center. And I love how this turned out as well with the actual gold ones, but I still have photos from her that I want to put up and do something with. So now there's just been a lot of little apartment updates, right? So I've seen, I've moved this plant as well to make this look like just like a green, does this make it brighter? There we go. Like it's just like very green on this side and I love that. But yeah, it's just opened up the countertops and made it possible to feel like we have more space than we do. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video when I maybe go record shopping, maybe buy some other stuff. And it's August now, so damn.